I think the drones are just as bad as the atom bomb, and they have to stop. And they're going to be in our own skies in a matter of years. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm here because uh, Oh, it's Thursday night and I wanted to do something on Thursday night. No, I'm, I'm here for the, the same reasons everyone else is. I want to see an end of this damn war. And uh, I want to see, I just heard that someone talked about the drones. Uh, the sad thing of the drones is, I think that our whole Air Force and Navy, our whole military is going to be based on this drone technology. We're not going to risk any of our own people's lives to fight wars and once that happens we're never going to end wars because we won't have a pony in the race and drones are going to create perpetual never-ending war and i want to see it stop while we can thank you okay i'm here tonight because the war economy is not working for me and it's not working for a lot of other people who have no voice. And I feel that it's my responsibility as someone who does have voice to speak up for them. Thank you. I think like um, Elaine was saying, this whole war economy is sucking money out of our, sucking money out of our country in a way that's not only harmful to the people here, but harmful to women and children and men all around the world. And the only people that really benefits are the corporations that make the guns and all of the corporations that supply the military with food and all the rest. And it's, it's sickening because these corporations are getting richer and richer and even the, the workers within those corporations are working for pennies. A lot of people are suffering, and uh, we, we've got to turn this around. People need to wake up in this country. Thank you. Well, I'm, I'm just here uh, because I believe we need a major overhaul of the policies being put forth by our government at this time uh, about putting our soldiers into danger when uh, it's not for any realistic good purpose uh, for letting Wall Street and the most wealthy run our government while we don't have enough jobs for mo so many of our American people and we don't have a good plan for doing anything about it. We've got to stop uh, importing so much more than we export. that I think we desperately need some kind of campaign finance reform in this country. Um, we have a corrupt system where our money drives the elections uh, and it's getting worse every election. And I think the people of America recognize that. So it's time, it's time for Congress to step in and do something about it. And I don't think they're going to do it unless the American people push really hard. That's why we're out here today. Thank you. Okay, why are you standing here, Bobby? Ten years, too long. Watch the mother get beat. 